Greetings Aquarius, welcome to your reading for the week of March 31st through April 6th. This is Wasted Traditions Tarot, I'm Tiffany. I've been away for a little while, I'm so happy to be back. I'm glad you're back. If you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. Aquarius, we're going to get an angel number for you, then I'll move over to my oracle oracle deck and get an overall energy for you and then we will use tarot for understanding and clarification spirit what is aquarius's angel number do tell let's find out aquarius zero three zero three taking chances aquarius Success, knowledge, friendship, impatience, freedom, optimism. When chances are present themselves, seize them and do something out of the ordinary Aquarius. Whether in your professional or personal life, you will find success by welcoming creative impulses and having faith in your own abilities. Trust in chance and take risk on opportunities that could change your life for the better, Aquarius. All right, 0303, taking chances for Aquarius. I'm going to go to the Priestess of the Light Oracle. Get your overall energy spirit. What is Aquarius's overall energy for this week ahead? Do tell. Sacred purpose, eternal flame, ancestral legacy. Wow. Wow, Aquarius. Sacred purpose, eternal flame, ancestral legacy, ancestral legacy, knowledge, hmm. sacred purpose. Very, this is a very spiritual energy I'm feeling for you, Aquarius. Very, hmm. Okay, let's get some understanding with the tarot. She has a light in her hand. Carrying that eternal flame. Your ancestors. Ancestral legacy. Carrying the torch. Keeping it going. Alright. Uh, where do I want to go with this? I want to... Oh, wow. Ace of Wands. Eight of Wands and the Four of Swords. Wow. Okay, Aquarius. Of course, the Ace of Wands is willpower, inspiration, creation, uh, desire. And this inspiration that I'm feeling for you, Aquarius, it is from your ancestral line there is something in your dna that is unique to your ancestral line wow this is amazing okay let's go ahead with the eight of wands we're going to get some more uh, clarification with the tarot right now eight of wands this energy, this ancestral legacy is coming toward you, Aquarius. This sacred knowledge in your ancestral line is going to be unlocked for you. Um, and this is, this is a chance for you to take uh, a new opportunity here with this Ace of Wands. It's a chance that's coming toward you rapidly. That you should take advantage of Aquarius. Okay. You have to seize the moment. I feel like this is very personal to you Aquarius. More than your professional life. And then here we have the four of swords. I'm feeling like this could be four generations back. Four generations back where this legacy is coming from. It feels like it's skipped Four generations and it's coming to you, Aquarius. If you're watching this, this is definitely meant for you to hear. 
understand and receive. Thank you so much for being here. This is not happenstance. This is divine connection for you, Aquarius. I feel like with this four of swords, this is four generations back. So this the eternal flame has been in a holding pattern for four generations until you Aquarius. So I'm also feeling, as we know, with the Four of Swords, we want to take a, a chance to rest so that we can clearly feel and hear spiritual guidance, right? Feeling our intuition can, can be heightened when we take time to rest. So also, that is what I'm getting. You have to get still Aquarius. It's a risk on an opportunity that is in your lineage, but this risk will be successful is what I'm feeling for you. All right, let's get some more clarification. We have the King of Swords, Six of Swords, and Ace of Swords. All right. Okay. Okay, Aquarius. This is showing me you're stepping into a position of leadership with this ancestral legacy that is coming towards you rapidly, Aquarius, okay? Um, you, you have the mental fortitude and intelligence to take this legacy and run with it is what I'm feeling. The intellectual power that you currently carry will only be enhanced when this sacred ancestral knowledge comes towards you. There's a purpose in your bloodline for whatever reason it stopped four generations ago. And it's been waiting for you to come into your intellectual power, which is right now, Aquarius. And it's coming towards you rapidly. Right. It's I feel like it's something that could have you could have had nudges or um, wondering why am I thinking about this? Because it's headed towards you rapidly and it will be revealed. So with the six of swords, I'm getting and feeling you are definitely protected on this new journey, this new path that is ahead of you. You are you are divinely protected by your ancestors, angels, and spirit guides. And they want to help you to move forward with this sacred purpose that has been in your family's DNA for generations to come. But for some reason, it was in a holding pattern until you, until now, Aquarius. Okay, and then we have the Ace of Swords. This is definitely you understanding this. You are at the beginning of your understanding and at the beginning of the knowledge of the sacred purpose of your bloodline. You will get, you will get clarity. You will get absolute clarity. Your soul's knowledge is about to unlock and be revealed to you what this actual sacred purpose is and how you can't how you carry the mantle from this point forward. It's been waiting for you in particular, Aquarius. It has skipped four generations. It's been in a holding pattern for four generations and it's been waiting for you and you're about to gain clarity on what that is exactly. I want to look at the bottom of the deck. Ten of Swords. And this one. Page of Swords. Yes, this is a lot. Oh, you have a lot of... A lot of knowledge. A lot of information seeking you. Right? This is a new beginning. You are about to transform and change your ancestral legacy. It's starting with you, Aquarius. You're about to change that, right? This is all new to you, right? The Page of Swords and the Ace of Swords coming up. 
all new information, but it's coming to you rapidly. It's coming to you rapidly and you are absolutely equipped to handle it. There's no mistake. It's been waiting for you for four generations, but you are divinely protected and it's about to transform the legacy of your family from you forward. Okay. I want another Oracle card. Divine Spirit, give me absolution here for Aquarius, if you will, please. Ego sublimation. Absolutely. Okay. What I'm feeling with this. This is no longer about just you, Aquarius. That's what I'm feeling with this vanishing mirror ego sublimation. This is greater than you. This is the legacy of your bloodline. So your ego is going to have to be pushed aside, sat down in a corner because it's so much greater than you. It's so much bigger than you. This work that you are meant to do, this sacred purpose all of this sacred knowledge that is coming towards you rapidly, it's so much greater to you than you. And you you are absolutely capable of handling it. You are absolutely intelligent and strategic enough to handle it. Clarity is with you right now. You must focus on what it is that is in front of you to know that it's not just about you. So it's a responsibility that comes with this ma this mantle of carrying and utilizing the sacred purpose of your bloodline, Aquarius. That is what I'm feeling with this vanishing mirror. It's not about you. It's so much bigger than you. It's a it's a family It's a it's a service a service to humanity that comes through your bloodline. And, and that's why it's so much greater than you. And it, it just, I'm feeling that for whatever reason, that legacy had to be put on hold. And, and the universe knows, source knows, the God of, a, of your understanding knows why. And it, it's, you may never find out why, and that's okay. But that doesn't mean you should not answer the call. There is something great for you to release into the world, and it's been waiting for you specifically, Aquarius. I hope that you take heed to this and trust it. Trust that you are capable and meant to do this because this is big, and it's so much greater than you. You have something amazing in your bloodline, something to release from your bloodline. Your ancestral legacy depends on you, and you are protected. You are guided. You are more than capable, Aquarius. Do the work.